One thing that I always like to kind of educate on is the overlap, because I really don't think people realize how one biome influences the rest. And we know these biomes are these collections of the microbes, their DNA, their genes, and people don't often realize how your gut microbiome can affect your skin microbiome or can affect your lung microbiome, can affect the vaginal microbiome. So I would love to hear just in your functional, your integrative, your traditional training, what you have learned at that intersection and how the bugs themselves affect one another, the byproducts of the bugs and how they affect their environments and things that women may experience if the bugs, the microbes, their genes are off. Yeah, I think in functional medicine, we focus so much on the root cause, right? The root cause of why someone is feeling poorly. And if you can, if you find the cause, so for example, if you're thinking of insulin resistance and blood sugar balances, and it causes disruption in the vag in the gut microbiome, it's going to cause the same issue in the vaginal microbiome and other microbiomes. So a lot of times in our world, when we're helping patients, we don't just see that one problem in one area of the body. That's the reason why it came to us to begin with, because they, you know, for in my world that come to me and say, well, I not only have crazy periods, but I'm also have terrible anxiety and I have bloating and I'm getting yeast infections. Like, so you can see how they all sort of tie to this underlying problem that often affects multiple areas of the body, which of course is gonna affect multiple microbiomes as well. 